Hey what's up guys, in today's video I am going to show you how to use dynamic request parameters in Elementor form without using any dynamic add-on in Elementor. So let's start. So guys first of all you have to insert the form there and then you have to change the labeling. You have to change the placeholder. Change it also date. And then you have to go to advance and change it also there. You have to change it also there. Check out. It must be date. And then you have to go to advance and change the ID also. And there you have to change it also. Adults. It must be number. And change it also there. And then you have to go to change the label there. Book now. And this is the main step. You have to add the action. Close this action. Action must be redirect. And go to redirect tab. Just insert the link. You have to redirect. Findgap.com question mark and then you have to give it parameter name check in and in the form you have to go to advanced and then you have to copy the short code name paste it there and then you have to add the and and then type checkout equal copy the another name short code and paste it there again and and uh, paste it adults copy the name short code equal and paste I am going to update the form refresh it and uh, I am going to select my dates check out date and the adult and I am going to click this button and as you can see it has redirect to another URL just with the same parameters check in check out and adults which I selected before and this is how you can use dynamic redirect functionality in Elementor Pro without using any add-on so guys if you find my video useful don't forget to like subscribe and share thanks for watching